Right guys, we've got an exclusive for you. So we're doing the update uh, from the Overland build. So a few changes. Um, the name, <laughs> Overland Earth has been changed to the Hive. So um, I'm gonna show you the truck, what we've been building at the moment, the guys have. And then uh, we've got to show you another box as well we're in production. Here we go with Mark's truck. Now this thing's a beast. You'd have probably seen this already on a few of mine. This, so we've got Mini Me. So we've got, this is a MAN crew cab. You've seen a few of the pictures. They're not the original wheels. So this is all getting custom done. We've got a, they're doing a special uh, Raptor. But this thing's a monster. This is getting built for going around the world big time so yeah they've just got all the new ladders that come in now unimpressed jeff aid he's involved in all the fit out you've seen on his video he did the other week along. yeah so he's the main man this is why they call him the hive so they've got a group of them all together all like self-employed all doing it themselves doing like a team so yeah, there's loads to go on this. There's big tail lifts and everything going on. Um, so, oh what? This is them um, like the GRP, like you know you saw next door on the on the big lorry, and then it's fully insulated. So yeah, they've just done the one coat at the moment. Everything's getting done. Everything's ripped out. We've got. Air conditioning getting fitted in there. There's air conditioning getting fitted into the truck. There's loads of stuff. Here's some of the tanks. I think it's 400 and something litres. They're having uh, a camera. That was the waste. That's the water tanks. Um, I think there's more. I think there's more water tanks. Um, massive fuel tanks. Um, doing double tanks. They've literally re-engineered the chassis. There's so much going on under there. You've seen in the other videos anyway. So. What are they using to build these water tanks? Oh, what? What are they using to build these water tanks? No, this, this is how they're bought. These are bought ones. Oh, bought it's like a special plastic. Yeah. Um, insulated and everything, so stops them from freezing. But, um, yeah, so, I mean, there's huge big winches getting put front and back. Um, all sorts. Right, let's go and have a quick look inside while there's no one here. So here we go. This is... I need to get a new phone. Here we go. We've got some layout pictures. There we go. So, in this part, as you come in through the door here, having two safari windows. This is all going to be the seating area. And I'm pretty sure there's drop-down hydraulic bed going in there as well. Um, I'm pretty sure that's you see there's units and stuff now the guy who's having this built um, he has his own furniture company so he's sorting his own cupboards hang on that cheat out of the way so everything's all motorcraft windows sky hatches air con you name it it's got every tool you can think of everything you can think of and it's got a big shower system into here Started, this is what I'm impressed Jeff is here for. <laughs> he's here for the electric bits and he's doing all the plumbing and everything. So I just wish I could earn some more money and get him in to do mine. Because that's one thing on my wish list now. To rip mine out, rebuild it. Is it having solar? No, what, well, this? Oh yeah, it's massive solar system. How this is basically, everything's there? going electric in this as How well. How many panels would you do? I'm not sure, I know there's a lot. I bet you could get about five, six. Uh, I think it's Energy Monkey, everything's been bought from. So, but yeah, so much. I mean, there's not any bits and bobs at the moment. Everything's got to be redone, cladded. It's loads to do. So, right, we'll take you outside. So, yeah, this is part of the watering system, and also it's going to be AIDS designed a recirculating water system for the shower. But, uh, oh, this is a. Oh, they're here. I didn't realise they was here. Oh, I want these. I wonder if you'll notice that they've all gone. <laughs> I think, do you reckon you'll notice that these have all gone and disappeared onto my truck? Oh, no, they're beautiful. 
These are, if you, if you go onto YouTube, check out Strands. These are amazing lighting system. Um, polycarbonate, you can hit them with hammers. Um, you can't really see in there. But these are sexy as hell. Very expensive. But what a kit. Um, it seems we've got a lot of them. <laughs> There's all sorts of little LEDs. Water filters if they But yeah, these are amazing lights, especially for Overlanders. You can bash them and hit them. Um, Have you got yeah? water filters in there? Uh, no, not yet. We're um, doing a, a similar kit. Obviously, like mine, mine was built on a basic budget. We use a... Um, we use... Oh, what was it we call? Oh, I forgot the name of it now. Um, Berkey. Berkey water filters we've got. But yeah, this is what I'm going to eventually go to. Recycling system, everything. When we upgrade. So, yeah. That's about it for now. Um, this next couple of months, this is hoping to be finished. So that flat out. So, right. We'll go and show you some more stuff. Right, so... A mate runs this place, and he, this is his little baby. This is what he's been real with. Now, if you go back to my videos when he was at the farm, this was an old Plaxton. Excuse the mess. <laughs> he knows where every tool is. This was an old Plaxton Mercedes. Um, for you geeks, I don't know if it's got a number. Here you go. It's an 814D. Now, this is an early thing, an early one. Um... He knows about it. It's got the diff ratios and all sorts, of whatever. But instead of... Um, he started stripping it, and it was more rust, more rust, more rust. So we come to the conclusion, he says, you know what? Let's build a new truck. So he's built... Basically, everything's done now. Chassis up. Everything's restored. And he's building a box. As you can see, he started the framework. So he's doing like an overlander. You can see the upswept there. Uh, seven and a half meters long in max, he's got it all. So I've been no doors, so it's just gonna have a single door in the side to get in. He's having a big bench seat made, um, he's having all sorts. This his plans is to go to Spain and stuff. This is Andy's, so he's got like log burner. You can see he's been marking out his log burning systems going in here. Um, yeah, that's where the doors go in. He's got like a coffee bench area and bed at the back. How tall is this compared to ours? This, I forgot the size, it's but it's massive. It's 14 foot something. I'm sure it was 14 something. But it's at your maximum. <laughs> it's having everything. It's got big bars. A lot going on. It's going to be a beast. So, yeah, this is Andy's project, which... It's going to come on pretty fast as soon as this out. So, yeah, this is what we're leading on to. This will be finished in a couple of months. So we'll have space for another build. But I'll show you next door from um, one of the dafts we sold and what we're doing with um, boxes and a cheaper old So if you remember, I put up a post for a deal with a box and a daff um, we'll be selling. Well, we've met up with a guy, Dave, who bought it all, and he's uh, doing it all himself, and he's part of the Hive community here. So he's working on this, and he's working on the other trucks as well. But yeah, he's chopped the height down, so it's a lot about the same as mine now. Now, I framed it all out. He's having, he's just been explaining how he's done. This, he's having a lot of stuff put in this. It's going to be an awesome truck when it's finished. He's having like the bed going long ways, shower room, the doorways going in there. He's got like windows either side. Again, he's got motorcraft windows um, all on order for this. But now he's gone for a cheaper option. So it's the GRP on the wood. So he, he's got HGV, so he's fine. Now, we can do these for people if wanted as a bit of a cheaper option. And these work out a lot cheaper um, than doing a big full one. But you can have it, you know, it's all fully steel framed, solid. All framed on the floor. So something else you can contact us about. 
because you can pick these bodies up a couple of thousand you know chop them down we can redesign it reprofile it do all sorts of things so it's another option we're offering to people but yeah this is going to look a really smart when it's finished i've just got to trim all up what do you reckon Good. You're going to get one when you leave school? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get a million so, In the description, I'll put the um, email down to... It's a special email we've got. It's obviously to Overland Earth. And I think if you remember, what, you'll know what it is, Archie. Is it hotmail.com? Uh, Overland... Overland Earth. Uh, at hotmail.com. Uh, hotmail It'll be in the description. So you can message me on there. Basically... Part of the group that I work for, I just do the internet for them. So try and find some new builds, um, bits and bobs like that. So to keep them busy. So as we're coming up to nearly finishing all this, um, there's going to be some space coming up. So anyone's interested in any sort of build work, from interiors to full builds, um, it's more trucks. We're not sort of going after the sort of the van life sort of market. Um, it's more the big stuff so anyone struggling to find anyone um, come and have a chat come and chat, chat with the lady the group is you know amazing group we've got together here um, you can always check uh, online on uh, YouTube you've got um, um, aid and his electric skills and plumbing and everything is just amazing so uh, I'll put a link to his website his YouTube in the in the description as well I've just lost it now. I've got his buddy. <laughs> He'll kill me. <laughs> but this is why I don't edit anything. So you know. Um, yeah, any any van adventures, I think it's called, or something like that. But I'll put the link in the bottom. He's got a few YouTube sites now. He's got more of electrical, because he actually teaches people now. So I'll put a link to that. His off-grid electrics sort of setup he's set up. Where you can go to a campsite for a weekend, full on training, it's like 200 quid. You get your food free, you get camping, everything, and full coach on how to wire up electrics um, for campers and stuff, so you can do it yourself. So, this is part of the service everyone here is trying to offer, and we're hoping as well to brand out. We're going to try and find some bigger units, and we want to rent bays out so you can have your own bay, rent a bay and there'll be people on site with knowledge who can help you with builds um, so you can do your own build as well that's coming up in the future so there's all sorts of stuff coming up so get in contact so yeah so i'll put all the information down below um, for all the links and um, get in contact so like i say we've got some spaces coming up soon so it's getting quick so we've got some updates so there's two of them big ones this, whoa, rated to minus 40, it's been tested. And then we've got new, this is a brand new project, secret this is. <laughs> so these are going to be, these are from Roma, and they're going to be starter, 24 volt for the truck, starter batteries. New going to be out on the market soon. Um, here's some of the other things. We've got the Webstow. Um, heating system was underfloor heating. We've got three of these going in. Got the new ropes are all here. Oh what? It is very tall. Where's the door now? I think as to about there. Oh, we're a lot lower. So yeah, there's um oh the new fridges, there's wash machines. Missed the fridge there. So on uh, one of them absorption I think there's a couple of them going in so all sorts of toys <coughs> so yeah this is going to be a, it's going to have every toy you can think of built into this so which is good because we can offer um, them like the strand lights and stuff we've done a deal with them so we can do a full kit um, with insulation and stuff um, Trying to see what other bits is laying around, but yeah, there's. I thought there was just them two, but no, that's <laughs> only one set. <laughs> there's all sorts of new winches. Why are batteries really heavy? They are. Well, they're, they're not. You can lift that one up. I can't. You can. <laughs> so, that's, that's not. That's not. But that's the, the Roma 
a hundred. That's the <coughs> that's been in for testing. So anyone who follows Jeff will know. That's been in his freezer, um, in a block of ice. This? It's been up Mont Blanc or something. Yeah, that ba that battery. Was it like indestructible? Testing it for its um, minor. It's supposed to be rated to minus Can't forty. Because lithium have a problem with the cold. So this is new version out. So there's all sorts coming. So yeah, keep an eye on the channel, and uh, we'll keep bringing you updates. So hopefully it'll be. Uh, Put to back together soon it's literally bolting parts on now and um, they've done all the engineering bit and that's what the slow bit is redesigning stuff redesigning clamps everywhere so it's the first major build they've done so they're having to all work as a hive this is why they're calling the name and uh recreate it so it's not like a off-the-shelf build totally unique so and then it's going to be tested Mark's going to be testing it up in Scotland um, so we can finalise any little things what need, you know, sort of fixing. But yeah, hopefully September we're looking at, uh, this should be on the road. So we'll bring you some more updates as it gets built. I thought I'd show you these ones. Now this one was on Facebook for a while. Uh, this is the local one and uh, it's getting converted here. This is uh, Phil's. Um, I think he's just had it, oh, it's been for its MOT and bits, but it's road registered, it just leaks and needs a whole box finishing off. But um, yeah, I think, yeah, I think he paid about 11 grand with this with a box. What the? Same, same as mine. Yeah, and then eagle eyed people will see Poppy. So yeah, this is in for fit outs and all sorts of bits of work. And then we've got Poppy, which is getting totally rebuilt. So you can go and watch his videos on the build. This is going to have loads of toys in it. Where is he? Is he in there? No, no, no. Hello! No, no, <laughs> got no, him. no, no. Morning. <laughs> so, yeah. Busy, 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 everyone is. New back door on. <laughs> so what do you it's want? It's like a stable door. A, me a medieval stable door. <laughs> <laughs> this is gone. And this is the new the new part of the Poppy. <laughs> poppy 2. <coughs> With an overlander kicktail on it. Yep. Yeah. Because if you leave it here parked for more than about 30 seconds, They'll weld a kicktail on. There could be air in. con and everything getting put on top. Cameras. Yeah, we've got um, <laughs> we've got a roof vent, which is like a cheap Max air fan. We've got a round window for the side, uh, and then we've got a door on order, which prevents us from finishing it. But uh, when that's all in place, yeah, that'll be a great little sleeping pod. Yeah. We'll quickly finish off at Dave's truck. I think it's was in a little video, but he's got the. Jay Horton's full pivot system. So that can be on, you can order that direct from J.E. Horton's. Right, bit of kit. Yeah, when we was here last time, it wasn't actually fitted. Whee! But that's the bit I didn't have on mine. I went for the springs. But yeah, so the box you saw in there, in the other is going to be put onto that and uh, we're still unsure with that one that could be for sale in the future we don't know so keep you posted hey guys a bit of peace and quiet right we're doing um, box builds and um, we have got space as well uh, as well as truck builds coming up uh, we do have space and we're offering box builds the beauty is we're back, no back on them. Um, we're starting at 15,000. Um, that's with a real Bob Basic box, insulated. So that's your truck off a, you know, off an old truck, cut down, reshaped, roof down, chopped to make them lower, and um, because obviously they're too high. Um, all ready to go straight onto your truck. We're starting them off at 15 grand, and then obviously they go up to whatever other work you want doing. Um, all boxes will be fully CAD engineered. Um, 
design 3D so you'd be able to design it as well um, or beforehand so <coughs> if you did want windows in you can then plan stuff like that with the, the CAD design with it um, some of the team members, one of the team members Dave, is a, he does all the CAD engineering drawings for you and then we can do whatever you want to the box There's, you know to a full build box um, but there's a lot of demand for a quick turnaround quick boxes now we can do them under a month uh, I'm saying a month because I know the lads are busy uh, they reckon two weeks they can knock one out two men two weeks no problem and um, that's for the basic builds so that's not like mine that this is more of the, um, the, the proper wooden type boxes with a laminate um, sides um, and then you can go uh, the extra length and extra strong and have it steel framed if you want which is a little bit more and then to the full-on windows roof vents that you know whatever you want putting in so you know but at the moment we're not that registered well not personally me but um, the, the group not that registered they're not registered until going to be next year so get in early this is only you know with no VAT to pay it's going to that money you pay in VAT will buy you probably all your Victron gear so something to think about so yeah if anyone's interested um, drop us an email um, I'll put the links in the bottom it's uh, overland um, earth at hotmail.com send me an email and then um, we can get you talking to the team and um, you can work out what sort of a build you want but yeah we're open at the moment to all types of builds you know truck wise we're not doing camper vans, um, it's more, you know, trucks. So from a box, if you want the Bob Basic one, we can help you out to a high-end build one, um, like the one we're building now, we can cooperate for that as well. So get in contact and enjoy the vlog, and you'll see some of the other trucks what's getting on. So, and uh, we'll chat soon.